has been the best way for me to find these stocks showing bounce opportunities? Well, you wait for them to stop going down and then you kind of look for some type of reversal candles or ranges to the upside. And sometimes you're looking at st something like SC, for example, it's like, you know, there's no obvious support on the daily. And that's why you kind of look at the weekly and monthly and you see monthly, it almost kind of hit the 50. And you can see it uh, with a lot of these uh, beaten down uh, past leaders over the past two, three years, they're all kind of bouncing off the either the 50 or the 20 weekly. For example, hubs, which I bought yesterday, undercut the 20 and tried to kind of bounce, you know, trying to reclaim. And all of these other stocks, you know, TTD, Twilio, they're all either kind of trying to bounce off the 50 or the 20 monthly, even though there's no support. So you kind of look at those types of levels and then you look at the candles, right? Are they bouncing? But they don't have to bounce. Like they can all go down another 30%. N none of these stocks have to bounce, but they're, I think, Yesterday was a good risk reward type of an opportunity.